how to video this you may recognize is the knife that i use for the wood filler video this is what i call the genesis knife because it's the first one i've actually created to full completion um, what we're going to do here is etch the blade i'm going to etch my last name in it what i've done is taken some painter's tape and use my laser engraver i just have a 1000 milliwatt laser engraver and i engraved my last name right there through the painter's tape and then i moved the tape over onto the knife and got it where i wanted i've got the the handle covered up because i got the nice wood and epoxy handle and i really don't want to get any vinegar or any chemicals on it so i've got it covered up with a plastic bag and some painter's tape and now i'm going to go outside and etch it with a 12 volt battery All right. so i'll see you there outside I've got the positive side of my battery hooked up, my vinegar and my Q-tips, and now I'm going to start the etching process. Keeping with the simple theme, if you follow me, you know how simple most of my projects can be. I am connected to my truck because I don't have all those fancy jump starters that some people have. got my wet q-tip here I'm gonna go ahead and start etching the metal with it you probably can't hear it but I'm hearing it hissing as it etches into the metal kind of see the metal beginning to turn colors. The little part of that letter is just completely coming off, so I guess the P is just not going to have its full uh, centerpiece there. It's incredibly hard to hold this camera with one hand and do this with the other. I'm trying to make sure I get a nice, even edge. All right, I couldn't record the entire uh, portion. I stayed out there for maybe five minutes or so etching and uh, I was getting eaten up by mosquitoes and I don't have enough hands to hold the camera and do that. So anyway, now I'm gonna take the tape off and see what we ended up with. And there it is. Not the cleanest etch, but I'm gonna clean it up a little bit and try to make it show up a little better by cleaning it up I mean first I'm going to start with a permanent marker and color over the whole thing and then I'm going to wipe it off with an abrasive pad and I've cleaned it up with just a little bit of alcohol and got the marker back out of it and uh, the edges are nice and refined now for the most part and I couldn't really be much happier with it for a, an etch done using my pickup truck battery and some vinegar and salt solution i'm very happy with it i'm about ready to call this knife done for my first knife i feel pretty good about it i'm happy with the way it's turned out i think it's going to be a nice blade to 
to keep in my family for a long time. So, if you've enjoyed this series, go ahead and subscribe to my channel so you can follow me on the next journey as I make another knife. Thanks for watching.